there at the end. I guess you're just trying to make a point at that point, but um, do you have any comment on any of that? Well, you know what? I've, I've, I've donated enough to the fund, um, and, you know, so I, I but I, I will tell you, I, I am looking forward to going back and looking at the pass that went in bounds to see if the girl was out of bounds and threw it in, and then the other one step, picked it up and stepped out of bounds. Because uh, if that's what took place and that's what I saw, and I, I may be wrong, but I, I just need a game to be administered correctly. And if you step out of bounds and throw it in bounds, it, it, unless the rules change and the, there might be an interp tomorrow that says if you don't mean to take it out of bounds, but you're out of bounds and throw it in, then it's okay for the other player who's in bounds to catch it and then step out of bounds. And maybe there is an interp that I haven't seen. So if that takes place, then I'll apologize. But if she was truly out of bounds and then throws it inbounds, it, at least at the fourth grade level, they don't let you do that. It might be allowed now, and I'm just, I, I, I didn't read that rule. So I will check on that. Um, and, I, and I could be wrong, and if I am, I, I'll apologize for it. But if, if I'm not, I don't expect to hear anything to say that it was, you know, a, a missed call. That's normally not what you get.